So I just did this to her. I got called her, then I hung up like three minutes later, I called and said exactly this, and I'm gonna do it again. Exactly what I'm about to say. Dad? Yeah? Is mom home? Yeah, she's just leaving. She's got uh, her stuff in the car. Nice. Where's she? Can she cut the doctor real quick? Oh, hold on. Hello? Mom? Oh, hi. I'm leaving all of them. I'm, I'm, I'm getting the car. Are you done yet? I'm done. Finished. I'm coming. So you, you get the food ready? I uh, everything ready. I'm coming. When are you going to be here? Four o'clock? I'm coming. If you want me to come, I'm coming. Come on. You're taking forever. Let's go. Come on. Okay. If, you, if I'm not talking to you, I'm going to my car. <laughs> What's up, man? How you doing? All right. Cut airline today, folks. We're going American. We're going to Phoenix, Arizona to go co-host and Frank Wright this minute. And then we're off to Ibiza. here at the airport, chilling, you know what I'm saying, about to get on that plane, go to Phoenix, you know, what it is. <laughs> I feel like I'm 32, I act like I'm um, 19 sometimes, I don't know, I got a kid now, so actually I'm like 24. <laughs> our girl Christiane What's from up? right this minute. She picked this up in her car and she's a prankster. Look at this. In her <laughs> visor, right? It's hot. The sun's out in the desert. You're like, oh, I'm blinded. Let me put the visor down. Ah, what the hell is that? She's got a bat it rat. It freaks people out all the time. That was my little prop from our Halloween show. I love that. That's cool. <laughs> Right, want some selfies? Go ahead and line up one by one. We'll get our selfies. We'll tag you on Instagram, follow you on Snapchat. Let's get it going. Right. Calm down. Don't show so much excitement now. <laughs> These guys are, they look like me a little bit, man. Thank you. Oh boy, we got a lot to work with here. Uh, shotgun on the treadmill. <laughs> actually happened to me, everything that you I just described. Uh, I know. So I was like, well, I don't want to do you know, that. I thought it was hilarious. Because we almost died on a bridge in Chile, trying to find hot springs. But and at the end of the day, the whole way. we ended up, we found hot springs, we were hanging out with a bunch of Israeli girls, and they were like half naked, and it was fun. It was a, that was the pot at the end of the gold, or whatever. <laughs> 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 Yeah. 
So I can cut through like I want to change like cuts through like bones. Bones? Yeah. That's yeah. kind of that's kind of scary. Yeah. Well, it is funny. Yeah, and you have bags of lime. I mean, lime, Lumber. acid, and duct tape and rope. Yeah. Yeah, I'll say. No, we don't. No, no. She don't. knows what's up. And what time do you get off work today? Um, six o'clock. Perfect. Do you guys have barbecue sauce here too? <laughs> yeah. Oh, here it is. So you want to know how to prank. Today we're going to make people think that you're pissing in the toilet at the hardware store. Just get a little cup because you don't want to make a mess. And that's your spot you're going to aim in, right? So no one can get too mad because nothing's really going into the toilet and it's just water. Let's check it out. Finger on top like this, right? So you can hold upside down. Okay. Grab the toilet and once the person comes by, I'll go, hey, this guy's pissing. I'll go grab somebody. I'm going to come over here. Give me a minute. All right, that was real. Hey, home people down the street. Yeah, we're going over there now. <laughs> Chest hair match the, the cleavage. Nobody wants to see a hairy cleavage. So, you know, it's just like oh, another shirt. Dude, I feel like I have a bra. I should trim right here. I can make like a hairy bra. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna make your mama wanna do Pilates. I'm gonna do Pilates so hard! Let's go. That was good, dude. Yeah, that was good. Yeah. Welcome to Reformed. We're about to do some Pilates. We have our beers. We got our instructor, Megan. Yeah. I'm here with Christian and uh, these ladies are literally gonna beat us up right now. And so to numb the pain, we thought we'd have a little bit of beer and we can just blame it on the alcohol. Closer to the center, the more points you get. 
it's like bowling alley meets driving range the way it's set up. So this is my boy Brandon Two. He did the Natural Born Pranksters logos and everything you see, all the stickers, all the MVP stuff. That's him. That's me. He did it. He's a graphic design artist and he's an American warrior ninja. That's right. Getting the GoPro head mount ready to go because we're about to climb Camelback Mountain. And Eric Walterman is about to bring all the gears we need. He's got everything. Oh my god, we're not back there. I brought everything we need to survive. For like just in case weeks. we got out of tent, just in case we get stranded. I brought my tent. Axe, shovel. Shovel. Like a blow dryer. Brought lotion. This is Putin, bro. What Putin. on earth is happening? It's only Mountain. It's, it's President Putin right in there. Let's do it. Hold on, hold on. Did you guys bring, um, oh. is that the only camera we have, by the way? Shit, I got one. Way up there. Oh. 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 We're at Cableback Mountain in Phoenix, Arizona, about to hike up. We can make it to the top. We're gonna make it to the top. This is the beginning. We're not even a quarter way up. We should, hike. <laughs> we should hike over there and I can hold you up over <laughs> Scottsdale. Shopping.com. Text mobile or me. You know you have a best friend when your family questions if you and your best friend are really gay or not. Look at this. this I don't know, it doesn't get much gayer than that, but that is the ugliest bra I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> Hey, oh my gosh, dude. It literally makes it look like my bre I have really breath. Howdy, partner. Hey, we're gonna go ride some bulls today, drink some beer, and wear Budweiser. We're gonna hey, drink some Budweiser today. Welcome to the western town of Cave Creek. Oh, 
Dogs and Horses in Cave Creek, Arizona, and my boy Eric Walterman is about to ride his first bull. Do we have a video in eight seconds? Man. What does it say here? You can get, lose your testicles. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Cows oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And it's not your fault, right? It's fine. Uh, that's exactly right. Uh, You're an adult. <laughs> well, this is my first rodeo. So. Sign that registration, boy. Signing your life away. Yeah, yeah. Do you guys need my insurance card too? No, don't need mine. You have a nickname? You want one? Uh, what's Walter. your nickname? Oh. Walter Man? No, I gotta have like a cowboy nickname. Like Iron Balls Walter Man. <laughs> That's it. Iron Balls. Iron Balls. like a Xanax or something <laughs> that calms down a It's bit. not a horse, it's a bull. <laughs> Piss that one off a little bit. He looks a little bit too calm. Piss him off. No, no, Get in there, no. get some kicks on him, slap him around a little no, bit. No, no, he's a That's good. That's what they do. He's a good little, good little cow. Good Yo, little cow. Yeah, that's what they do. They slap it around and make them sick. I think we should play some Whitney Houston. Something, something relaxing. <laughs> Just go ahead and get down there. Get down on him. Cut it back. Cut it back. Cincinnati. Cincinnati. Cincinnati kid, baby. Cincinnati kid. Job's done, man. Side up all the way up on top. If you're ready, you nod your head. You nod your head, it's gonna happen. Just nod your head. Keep both legs wrapped around. You're good to go, man. Right there. Perfect. Perfect. Right there. Right there. Nod your head. 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 Put your hands up. Yeah! Woo! That was pretty good. Good job, bro. How are you? I'm gonna do it again, dude. I'm gonna do the harder, the harder. I think it's just no, that's dirt. Like dirt <laughs> dude. That's dirt. Oh, you gotta take a shower. <laughs> I won't smack it, but I wanna see it again. I know this guy way too well. He's gonna be like, oh. Oh. Alright, so Christian took us to Headcase Motorcycles. This is where all the customization is gonna happen. These are Christian's buddies. They're, yeah, they're yeah, yeah. But yeah. they also customize motorcycles, which means that we'll be able to do basically whatever we want to Exactly. And when we were talking about this prank, she's like, I know exactly where to go, right here. Oh my oh, gosh. So good to see you. Long this is Dennis. Yeah. I haven't seen him forever. Like the first time now. Yeah. What's your name? This is Mary, Mary Beth. Beth. Mary Beth, what's up? Yeah. Thanks for participating. Cheers. She is hooking this up, making it happen for us. Oh my gosh, Nick, you're going to love this. All the attention you never knew you wanted, you're going to get. So you are welcome. What I don't understand, Nick, is what makes you think anybody wants to put your bike in a magazine, dude? <laughs> <laughs> Where's Dennis? Where is Dennis? He's taking a poop. He's he's always he's always <laughs> taking, taking the bathroom. He's always Are taking, you serious? He's always taking random poop. He doesn't tell anybody. He's gone for like an hour and a half. Everyone's like he's been gone for like two hours. He's he he disappears whenever he disappears. It's a lot of he's taking the deuce. Nachos he's been having. Yeah. He, he sits there on his phone and like t like there's something. I, don't I know saw what, how he was Facebook protecting and, that guacamole he yeah. brought in. Yeah, he probably has like little like red marks on his kneecaps. <laughs> his feet are all, all going numb. He's like, oh man, look, now he watch that. Out when he watches back in, we're gonna. To look at his kneecaps and see if he has red marks on him from his arms sitting there on the toilet. Oh. I bet you $20 that's gonna happen. Lift up your shorts. <laughs> oh. <laughs> that is hilarious. <laughs>
<laughs> That's from uh, they, called it. <laughs> they did call it. <laughs> What's up, bro? Today I'm a photographer for Moto Magazine. And whose bike do we have today? Nick Calderon's bike. It's a very special bike, especially after you get to see what we've just done to it. <laughs> you finally got out! <laughs> Dewey, do do let's find out exactly what's happening.